This is Pioneer's DMH340EX. This is a 2DIN AM-FM digital media receiver with a 6.8 inch capacitive touchscreen and built-in Bluetooth for both hands-free calling and wireless streaming audio. The Bluetooth system is designed to work with your Android phone and your iPhone. It can play back videos and music from a USB flash drive. There are RCA outputs for operating external amplifiers, and it has a 13-band graphic EQ. Let's take a look and see what's in the box. Just flip this up. Pop that one open. Okay, the first thing I see here is the installation screws. There's our install screws. Next up is a kind of a hardware pack. Let's take a look at the hardware pack here. Inside the hardware pack, the first thing we have here is the wire harness. We'll use the wire harness here to connect uh, power and ground and all the electrical connections from the in-dash receiver over to the vehicle. Next up, we have the input-output wire harness here. Next up, we have the Bluetooth microphone. Now, the Bluetooth microphone here comes on a wire about 10 feet long or so for very flexible installation. And this, is, this is used for making hands-free Bluetooth phone calls. And finally, we have a USB extension in the box because the USB port is on the back of this receiver. You'll use this USB-A extension to bring the USB port up into the passenger compartment of your vehicle. Next up, we have the quick start guide and the warranty card inside this one envelope here, quick start guide and warranty card. And remember that you can download a complete copy of the owner's manual for this product right onto your cell phone in PDF form from pioneerelectronics.com. And let's pull the receiver up out of here. There we go. This is a digital media receiver, and that means it doesn't play CDs or DVDs. You can see that it's a shallow chassis receiver, and that opens a lot of interesting installation options for different vehicles. The front panel of the DMH340EX has the volume control right here. And this is the home button here. This is a digital media receiver, and that means it doesn't play CDs or DVDs. You'll do most of your interaction with the in-dash receiver through the 6.8-inch capacitive touchscreen. On the back panel of the Pioneer DMH340EX, we'll start off with the AM-FM antenna from the vehicle, and that'll plug in right here. This jack is to plug in the Bluetooth microphone for making hands-free Bluetooth phone calls. The microphone is included with the in-dash receiver. This one is for using your vehicle's steering wheel controls to operate the receiver with the use of a third-party steering wheel control adapter. Here is the Type-A USB port. You can use this to play back music and videos from a USB flash drive. And we include a USB extension in the box so you can bring this USB port up into the passenger compartment of your vehicle. The RCA input and output wire harness will plug into the white port here. And we'll take a closer look at that input-output wire harness in just a moment. This is the 3.5 millimeter auxiliary input jack. It can be used to play back audio and video through the in-dash receiver. And finally, the wire harness connected to the vehicle will plug in right here. The Pioneer DMH340EX has a built-in amplifier that's designed to operate up to four speakers in your vehicle. Now, let's take a look at the input-output wire harness. Here are the front and rear right and left RCA outputs and a mono subwoofer output for operating external amplifiers. If your subwoofer amplifier has two RCA inputs, simply use a male-to-male -male RCA Y adapter or splitter to connect your amp. And these are two volt RCA outputs. The brown jack here is the dedicated backup camera input. The DMH340EX is designed for use with the optional NDBC8 backup camera from Pioneer. The yellow port here is the video output. And that is Pioneer's DMH340EX. And what's in the box?